Hey, good morning, everybody. This is Johnny at uh, Sochi Balls RC. Uh, just coming to you with another, uh, I guess, project, uh, upgrade, whatever, uh, video. Uh, so this is cause uh, SCX-103 uh, ran once indoors. Uh, decided to do some upgrades to it. So... <clears throat> First one was the crate, uh, boom racing crate, uh, extra wide aluminum three piece wheels uh, on the gladiator. Uh, I don't know if it's a gladiator. It's a SX103 stock needles, uh, trail grapplers. Uh, I know it's hard to see it with the trail grapplers, needles. <clears throat> yeah, also uh, shorten the bumper posts, bumper posts, and trim the body so that you can get a little more uh, departure angle. So. Uh, started out with about 45 degrees, uh, about 50, 51, 52 degrees now, so it's better. Um, also, uh, let me see, sorry, let me take off the body post. You find it on that side. Uh -huh. Hold on. There we go. There you go. Two. Such a humbug, especially after you do the. Especially after. Uh, my wife said, "Give him my wife, my son, crap." When you shorten these, this rear bumper, it, it's gonna be a bitch to get those body clips out. But, <clears throat> for the anger, for the departure angle and just all out looks, it's worth it. Just gotta, Okay, we got one. Sorry about that. Let's see if I can get the, this other one. So I can feel it. Uh, it's right there. I'm trying to be an asshole. Okay. Gotcha. Let's see if you come on now. There we go. Okay. Just like that, hoo hoo, the body can come off though. Yeah, not with the bumper, but we have to remember. You have the light wiring. So, let's disconnect that. This is fun to do with one hand. So, yeah. yep, one. There we go. Now, it'll come right off. There we go. Body and chassis. Let's put it over here. With the, a bunch of crap. Okay, so let's try this. There we go. So, of course. Crate wheels, my boom racing, you know, stock needle tires, but the wheels fills out the tires beautifully. It's like it's made for it. It's uh, it's it's nice. Uh, but I mean, it fills it up better than these. Uh, also boom racing, 
but it's a it's a one nine pretty much the stock size it's basically these wheels these crate wheels uh the extra wides is about almost twice the width as the stock ones so imagine how much it fills yeah. and these are the stock wheels yeah, those. and again you know look at the look at the difference i mean it's beautiful all right now that that's okay let's put that over there so what we did up front was uh well of course we tied up the wires as good as we could but we also took off the rear uh battery tray so the reason why we took off the rear battery tray is because you don't want extra weight sitting on your back you want your extra weight as much as possible to stay up forward so we kept the stock side mounted and just added the extension off of the one side off of the rear so that you can put a little bit of bag, better, bigger battery pack uh, and then also it helps with the side to side weight difference because this side has all your electronics so it's a little more balanced and it's a little forward a little more forward so it helps with that uh, that forward weight uh, also uh, since we cleared that rear uh, battery tray there's two tabs for your mounting for your battery tray that sat here uh, at compression it would touch these two links so now with out it without it there you can actually the clearance is all the way to your chassis so now it sits all the way to your axle and um, you know the less bind binding I guess the better right you get more articulation you get uh, better clearances I guess so we went from here to now look we got you know about a half inch three quarters of an inch more clearance and it sit at all the way to the to the axle you know I don't know if you can see that but it sits all the way to the axle now so okay so the next one was uh we move the shot position forward all the way to the top to the top all the way forward give it a little more of an angle and so with the rear uh all the way to the top all the way to the to the rear and uh i mean we gained about a half inch to three quarters of an inch uh i'm sorry about this clearance and uh we went from about three and three quarter inches to about four and a half so yeah this is Yeah, I mean, I think it's more than enough, you know. Yeah, all wheels up on the ground. We got about four and a half, about four and a half inches maybe. Well, I, I measured that earlier, but this spring is still not fully compressed, so, you know, we still got a little more that we can to travel so I mean for free mods besides the crate wheels anybody can do it I mean if you can get that little bit more of uh, performance out of your rig uh, especially out of a brand new rig you know do it I mean it's free I mean besides the wheels uh, it's all free mods, you know. Look at ways that you can re you can mod your new vehicles, and 
you know, get the most performance that you possibly can out of it. Uh, well, this is Johnny signing off. Thank you guys for spending time with me. Uh, for Salty Balls RC, you guys have a wonderful day. And my days. It's not that bad looking. I mean, there's some some overcast, but beautiful day in the neighborhood. All right, guys, you guys have a wonderful Sunday. Hello.